Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to Brenda's Universe. My name is Brenda Wallace. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right quick if you haven't already. All right, so in today's video, I'm going to be talking about one of my dating stories. Uh, for those who don't know, I've been single for going on five years and I've been on a few dates, some good, some bad, some confusing, some irrelevant. So with this particular dating story, it's somewhere in the middle. <laughs> I don't know. But let's get right into it. Okay, so about two, three, probably three years ago, I was um, talking to this guy. We met on Jacked. Um, I'm going to call him, I almost said his real name, Arnold. So me and Arnold, we, 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 we would talk on Jack or whatever. And we had good conversation, I thought. And we were talking, you know, getting to know one another. And so I asked Arnold out on a date. We went to TGI Fridays for the first date. Um, and since, of course, since I asked, I was going, I was willing to pay. Arnold was a pescatarian or a vegetarian. I don't remember which one he was. So I went to Fridays thinking that they had seafood options or, you know, vegetarian options. They had a veggie burger. So I was like, okay, cool. We can go there. You can, you know, have this. The date was really awkward. Like I kept trying to, you know, make little jokes, make him laugh, get to know him more, talk to him. But he always, it always felt like there was a block. Like it was never, I didn't feel like there was like good communication. Like I feel like he wasn't all the way there and me being nervous kind of like blocked my energy, but I was still trying to be, you know, forthcoming and accepting and just talk, let's, let's talk, let's talk, let's talk. So the date ended, I gave him a hug and then we left. And then, you know, again, we kept talking, kept talking, good conversation. We FaceTimed a couple times. And you know, that was our whole like situation. So then I asked him to the movies and went to go see the movie Slight. I don't know if anybody remembers the movie Slight. It was Jacob Lattimore and he was a magician. Um, it was a very nice movie. I saw it twice and I really enjoyed myself. Um, I took him to go see the movie. And after the movie, I walked him to his car and I was like, you know, second day, Shawty, you know, maybe, maybe I can try this. So I asked if I could kiss him and he was like, yeah. And it was awkward, not only for him, but for me, it was real, real uncomfortable. And even though, you know, we had this rapport that like we was good, we was Gucci, it was still like real awkward, but I was happy. I. I, I did it, but it was just like, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> and so then a couple days go by and then he comes to me and says that he is not over his past situation. He's still trying to figure himself out in this new realm of life, blase, blase, blue, 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 blue. The usual, it's not you, it's me. Um, and I was like, all right, whatever, cool, you know, do you, good luck to you, whatever, whatever. Cause that's how things usually go. When it comes to moi, um, I'm very forthcoming, I'm, I'm, I'm all into it. And then guys turn around and they're always just like, nah, I'm cool. Or the ones that are into it, dang shit. So, <laughs> ooh. But yeah, so then a few months go by and he's dating someone now. But like on social media, like they all boot up and stuff. But shout out to y'all. That always happens. <laughs> it's always a no for me, but you go and date somebody else right after me and y'all fall in love. Like why, why, do, why, what I do? Is it me? Is it me? I don't know, but that is a very interesting dating story of mine. I have one more that I don't really want to get into because <sighs> it's so stupid. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't and leave a comment if you're feeling generous. I love you all so much. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Deuces. Holla at me. It's your boy for show. Sure.